I'm down with horchata gold just because you know I'm Mexican. I love horchata, and you know there's all there's people now that are just like, yo, Jamaica over horchata. Like nah, yeah, like Jamaica is good, but horchata will just always have that special place in my. <laughs> What's up, everybody? Welcome back to another beer episode on Beers with Tiki. And on this beer episode, we're doing a beer review. Oh, what a surprise, right? Uh, we're doing a beer from Border X Brewing called Orchata Gold. So I got some new running shoes and I went to the gym to try them out. Dope, I love them, super comfy. But, you know, as I'm working out, I'm just like, damn, beer. Beer, beer. <laughs> I don't know if anybody else gets that when they're working out and just like, damn, a beer sounds ten times better than it did like ever before. You know what I mean? It just, it just sounds really good, like, especially when you're lifting some. <laughs> but yeah, when I got finished with the gym, I'm like, you know what? I'm gonna go to uh, Border X Brewing since it's like really close to me. So they're out in Bell, California, and a buddy of mine, Josh. Shouts out Josh. He's like, oh, dude, you should get this beer and review it. And I'm like, Orchata Gold? I'm down with Orchata Gold. Just because, you know, I'm Mexican. I love Orchata. And, you know, there's all, there's people now that are just like, yo, Jamaica over Orchata? Like, nah. Yeah, like, Jamaica's good. But Orchata will just always have that special place in my heart. <laughs> Anyways, this is uh, Imperial Golden Ale with Mattis. Madagascar vanilla bean and Sri Lankan cinnamon. So that seems pretty trippy, right? I don't know. Look at the look at the ingredients at the bottom right there, right? So it's sitting at 8.5% ABV. A little heavy hitter right here. So we're gonna we're gonna waste no time and just pour up. It's golden, that's for sure. It looks like it's honey. I don't know if you like if you guys could distinguish it, but like it looks like a thick layer of honey just like rising up to the top. It's a little bit lighter at the bottom, but yo, this thing smells delicious. What is it? Uh, Sri Lanka cinnamon and vanilla bean. You know, imperial golden ale, vanilla bean and cinnamon. You know what? I'm gonna go ahead and try it out already. Here, let me pour the rest of it right here. I'm gonna try it out already, uh, and then I'll tell you guys what what the hell is up with this. Okay, so Border X Brewing. I picked this up at Border X Brewing. I really hate that I couldn't get the single can or at least mix and match. I had to get the four pack, but I'm like, you know what? Whatever. I'll get the four pack, and uh, you know. So it says right here, I just literally just read it right out, the horchata experience. But real quick, uh, I've been to Border X before and honestly, I tried a, like a couple of their beers and none of them were, none of them were great. I, I was like, yo, what, what, what is this? Uh, you know, people like the pepino sour, but I was just like, even the sour wasn't that great, at least for me. And, you know, I, I really, I really don't dislike a lot of beer. I guess I was just expecting more because it's a brewery and I tried all of their beer. I'm, I'm, I'm kidding. I tried a good amount of their beer and I was just like, yo, none of these hit. Like, different types of beer I tried. Like, it, it just wasn't hitting for me. I was like, damn, this thing is not great. So, now I'm picking up this, I picked up this four pack of the Orchata Gold and being at 8.5%, here, let me try it again. You kind of taste the horchata in the background and what is it like the cinnamon vanilla and cinnamon for sure are like just bonding together like they're the best buds and I, I taste it right next to each other like the vanilla and the cinnamon that's like right there definitely taste that it's uh it's a real heavy hitter it's 8.5 uh you could definitely taste the the high ABV in this. You know how most of the time I'd be like, oh, this one's super smooth. Like, oh, this one's not even an 8.5. Like, no, no, this one's for sure is an 8.5. Uh, maybe like an eight, maybe between eight. For sure, it, like you'll taste it and it's like, it's really, really heavy. Uh, 
Yeah, it tastes, it's like the horchatas are way in the background, but like the vanilla and cinnamon are definitely present together in this beer. And I don't know how I feel about it. I'm just gonna go ahead and say this. I won't order this beer again. It's it's not that great. Like being an 8.5, yeah, sure. I, uh, it's, like, let me read from the can real quick. It says, Orchata Golden has soft vanilla and cinnamon notes. That's what I just explained. <laughs> Dancing atop a silky smooth body of oats and golden promise. It delivers an elevated Orchata experience. Uh, let me just say it does, I, I don't see the elevation of the Orchata experience. <laughs> but you know what? Uh, golden Orchata, Orchata Gold. Uh, from trying this, I see when, like, I taste the words Orchata Gold, you know what I mean? So, the Orchata is definitely present, it's kind of... Orchata Gold. It's, it's literally what the beer is called, Orchata Gold. I feel like that's what it is, like, exactly, and it's 8.5%. Uh, from what I've heard, and some people have told me, uh, uh, Beer Thug Live is opening up his shop right there at that same location at Border X. And uh, honestly, like, I, I love Border X. Like, I love the the setting inside like it's like super like it's big high ceilings they even have the top part that they didn't open but uh yeah it's a it's a cool vibe you know what i mean but uh like i think people just go for the location and i guess yeah, sure the beer is there but the beer isn't as great like i i just thought i was gonna think i don't know why i thought it was gonna be like I, I don't know why I thought highly of them. I was just like, oh yeah, brewery down the street from me, not too far from me. I'm down to go check it out. And then I go check it out and it, um, the expectations were very, very low. I was like, I mean, they were, I guess they were high, but they're low for me now. I was just like, ah oh, man, this, this beer isn't that great. Like, I like that it's an 8.5, but Orchata Gold, uh, I don't know, I, the name, I was, the reason I got it, I was like, oh yeah, Orchata Gold, and then a buddy recommended it because it was strong, and he said he got, you know, Josh, <clears throat> he said he got a, like a, a huge head change when drinking one of these, so I'm like, you know what, I'll try it out, and the can art is pretty sick, right, you can't, can't complain with the can art, pretty sick, even in the bottom part of it, right, but... I'd have to rate this beer uh, 6.5 out of 10. Not that great. Not that great for me. It's I don't know if I'm being like leaning towards more like, oh, yeah, all the other beers that weren't great. But this one, uh, I guess it is a heavy hit or something to you know, get the buzz going. But I would not get this again. I, I don't know. I don't even want to pour the rest of it in. <laughs> no, that, 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 that's messed up. But 6.5 out of 10 uh try it out for yourself you can it's right here not too long if you guys are in la county i know some of my subscribers most of my subscribers are local uh but go check it out and if you want more beer reviews consider subscribing to the channel because i'll be reviewing beers for you so you don't have to buy it uh this one let me just tell you uh you you, you probably need to try it on your own 8.5 percent abv and just just go with it. See, see, see what's up. But I just, they, I like I said earlier, I dislike that I couldn't get, uh, you know, a single can just because I wanted to try a single can, or uh, you know, mix and match with different beer that they had available. But now I'm stuck with three other beers. <laughs> but uh, cheers, guys. To the next one.